Joe Biden is an evil man, and he's a stupid man. I mean, what is he evil about him, in your estimation? Look what he's done to this country. Well, he's a corrupt liar. What about Vice President Harris? I think she's a dumpster fire. In what way? Because, you know, if you look at her policies, you look where she stands, look where she's done. Uh, you know, she, I don't even know if she's ever even gone all the way down to the border yet. We have major problems on our border. That's one of her jobs. She is out of touch with any turnaround in normal voter. Vice President Harris. No, I don't think she has a chance. Your Senator Ted Cruz said that he thinks that, that Michelle Obama could beat uh, Donald Trump and is maybe the only person who could definitely beat him. Uh, do you agree? Well, I think it depends on if the Democrats are willing to listen to more lies, pablum, uh, ridicule from their side, but not, not really any real solutions, except their continued uh, problems that they're creating for America. And they're just going to continue the, the problems they're, com they're committing for everyday citizens. You know, at some point, their folks are going to have to feel that the pain that their own parties throw in their direction because it's going to hit them. I think the Biden supporters all think alike. If you don't agree with they, what one person says and you disagree, such as they were floating around a time ago that when is Donald Trump going to get arrested for all the deaths of the Capitol Police officer on January 6th? I wrote back, I said there were none. And if you really do your research, none of them were officially died at the hands of January 6th. Now, I'm, I'm bringing up something that people are going to go, blah, 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 blah. But I did my research on that one, and I know why. Where, where did you do that research? I looked on uh, just media, news media on, on the Internet. When you talk about evil and Joe Biden, do you think that Joe Biden has blood on his hands for what happened on Saturday? I, I think Joe Biden and the Democrat Party are entirely 100 percent responsible for the horror that happened on Saturday, yes. With, with the, the, when the registered Republican shot and tried to kill the president? Uh, he's a 20-year-old registered Republican. I know, I know many people, I know many radical lefties who will tell me the story that, you know... Well, he's a registered Republican, that's all I said. When I was 18, I was proud to be a registered voter. I know people who, you know, when they get old enough to vote, daddy drags them off, fills out the paperwork, tells them to vote in the primary as a Republican. It doesn't mean they're Republican. There's also proof that when he was, I believe, 17 years old, he donated $15 to a very left-wing liberal PAC. He did that of his own accord. I mean, so he he registered as a Republican because someone told him to, but he gave 15 bucks on his own. Being registered as a being registered as a Republican or anything means nothing. So you're it's one thing if you look. It's like baptism. If he was a registered Democrat. Would you be saying the same thing to me? Uh, no, I'd say he was a registered Democrat, but I don't believe. No. I, I, right. Well, that's all I was 